Good day everyone! Our research title is Project Akap Capis. Ate, kuya, kaakapay sa pagbasa, kabataan, pag-asa sa pagbasa. A reading intervention program to enhance students' reading performance in Kaypaaba Elementary School amidst the pandemic. The authors, Christine G. Bilando and Angelique A. Manalo. Introduction Based on the monthly result evaluation, Kaypaaba Elementary School discovered that several of the students' reading levels have decreased. Our school has specific requirements and must change to meet those requirements. After assessing our pupils' reading levels, we develop a needs intervention program or activities that are seen as the only way to reach them. As a response to the urgent need to address the reading issues of learners in the frustration level, during this pandemic, Kaypaaba Elementary School will adopt Project Akap KPs, a localized innovative reading curriculum anchored on bawat bata bumabasa. With the support of our partner Sanggo ni Ang Kabataan ng Kaypaba, we were able to modify and enhance print resources in modular distance learning to continue helping struggling readers in the COVID-19 pandemic. Research Problems 1. What is the reading level of the learners before the implementation of the program? 2. What is the reading level of the learners after the implementation of the program? 3. Is there a significant difference before and after the implementation of the program? 4. What are the perceptions of the kuyas and ates after the implementation of the program? 5. What other supplementary programs will be crafted to continuously monitor the progress of the learners? Innovation, Intervention, and Strategy Sa Akap Kapis, Ate Kuya Kaagapay sa Pagbasa, Kabataan Pag-asa sa Pagbasa, a reading intervention program to improve students' reading performance in Kaypaba Elementary School is a continuous program bonded by a random of agreement between the Sangguniang Kabataan or the Ates and Kuyas and the teachers. Teachers supplied reading resources to learners at the frustration and instructional levels, but this study focused on students in frustration level. The Ates and Kuyas function as guides and assisted students with their reading exercises on a regular basis. A reading monitoring tool was used by the SK to assess the respondents' reading abilities. The SK will also took part in the online reading test. The reading monitoring tool was also used by the teachers to validate the students' reading abilities. The Sangguniang Kabataan of 11 barangays in the municipality of General Emilio Guinaldo collaborated on this initiative. Methodology Participants For the school year 2021-2022, the initiative involved 174 students from Kaypaaba Elementary School. Data gathering methods, the teachers at Kaypaaba Elementary Schools utilize the reading monitoring tool to conduct an online reading pre assessment or phone calls to identify the reading level of the students. Data analysis plan The data was examined quantitatively and qualitatively. The quantity of the learner's reading level was determined using a percentage distribution before and after the program is implemented. A paired t-test was used to determine whether there is a significant difference before and after the program is implemented. A descriptive qualitative approach was used as well. Findings This shows the graph of pre-assessment reading results in English and Filipino. Graph 2, this is the comparison of reading results in English and Filipino of the pre-assessment and the post-assessment. Graph 3, post-assessment reading results of English and Filipino. Conclusion Based on findings of the study, the researchers concluded that the program ACAP KPs was considered effective. Shown is the statistical result of the study. Recommendation The program ACAP made the researchers craft a continuous monitoring program for the students, a program that will help the students or pupils in developing their reading skills. This is the supplementary programs crafted that will enhance students' reading skills. These are the references used by the researchers.
Thank you so much and have a good day to all.